Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the internet. What's the pick here, man? You don't, he don't know. Yeah, I have no idea. He don't know this format, don't know this format well. that well. I'm going to take this giant killer. This card's great. Destroy a creature with power four or greater. And then you can tap things after you cast it as a creature. And then hopefully, like, Mysterious Pathlighter comes back. Hopefully someone just passes an Oko. That'd be great, right? Yeah, someone's going to pass you a $45 card. That'll be the day. Solid as a mic. Oh, Sir Allen. The Lion's Claw. That just sounds like a Game of Thrones reference, right? Looking for that cube link to make commands and also... Uh, it's not updated, guys, but I'll, I'll link it. When I first saw Oko, I thought he was weak. Then I watched Frank Rex and Eldrazi with it in the Sultai Super Friend. Eldrazi? Oh, was that in... um? Oh, yeah, that was in Modern, right? Because we... um. Yeah, because they had, like, Eldrazi Displacers, and, like, we were just like, all right, I'll turn your Reality Smasher into a 3-3. Yeah, that was actually surprising. Run um, away, Dad, never coming back. Wow. <laughs> Run away on Maccabee's track. All right, I'm just going to take this, uh, this Sir Allen, the Lion's Claw. Oh, I guess you did sing it. Yeah. Oh, I thought you came up with that yourself. He requested it, so I... Did it. So I did it. <laughs> uh, how do I? No, this is not. Can I go? Where's my? Where's my, no? I want to go to my list. Why is Ben's cube showing up? I don't know who that is. What user? I don't know who this is. I don't know what's going on. Glass casket is nice. Wow, these white cards are right here. I'm trying to find my cube for these guys on the, on the on the internet. On the internet. I'm trying my to find cubes. my cube for on the internet. And his, all right, here we go. I found it. View the list. Okay. Here is my cube. Oh, you got it. Wow, I hate you guys. <laughs> Whatever, it's still... Oh, you guys already... You guys already linked it. Well. Back, nag, nag, nab it. This card is great. And every time I'm able to get this early enough to, to for it to decide my colors, I'm super thrilled. I, okay. I would say that this card is... uh. Solid as a rock. You got that? Yeah, man. Okay. Oh, man. I like these two in combination because then my whole team gets plus two, plus two. Yeah, it seems good. So, apparently, my friend Justin Vizarro on Facebook was playing this deck in standard and he's like I went I went 9-0 with this deck and then apparently he went 16-0 and then 22-3 before he just stopped and I'm like good lord man so I'm tempted to put this together and try it at some point maybe I'll do one real quick after uh, after dinner Solid as a I'm gonna take this rally for the throne especially with the two the two pump effects are we just mono white right now so far. How's your shiny D? It's not really burning my throat, but it's pretty good. Is it real concentrated there? Yeah, it is. Yeah, I can't really I like how you said, anymore. but it's pretty good. As if, like, the burning your throat is what makes it good. And yeah. even though it's not doing that, it's still pretty good. That's what you drink it for, man. That's don't what you throat. don't drink it for. No, man, you got it all backwards. Buddy, listen. I feel like I go, uh green white quite frequently but whatever I think it does well sometimes Gar Garden Briggs Squire 
Can I get a coffee delivered today? That thing. See the squire. Uh, scalding collar is not bad. I'm just gonna take the two drop though. I like having some two drops. How much do you think a coffee delivery would cost? Probably like ten, nine, ten bucks. Yeah, it's not worth. No. It, oh wow. Oh, that's pretty shizzle though. It's terrible. Yeah. My recommendation is wake up before five p.m. and then just go get one. It's a good recommendation. Yeah, that's that's what I would do personally. Solid. Solid is a rock. Yeah, I, I, that's what I, that's what I would say. I'll just wait. You sure, man? Because I don't know if you can wait. Once and future. Or Lonesome Unicorn. Which is it, my dude? Which is a, what's I don't a pig, know what man? either of those do. What's the pig, Michael? <laughs> uh, I'd go with the creature. Off the basis of creatures are good. We do. We actually have a Keurig. Mike just doesn't have... I don't have any coffee. He doesn't have any Everything coffee cups for it either. Uh, I'll take... Oh, God, it's raining. Oh, jeez. I can't even... It's raining in such a way that you can't even see outside. No, a little monitor. A little monitor? Yeah. What do you? You didn't take the little monitor. Oh, another little. What are you talking about? A little monitor. A little monitor boy. Hey, little monitor boy. He like scries when he comes in. Play. Monitor boy that scry. Oh, what? The corridor monitor? Yeah. That doesn't scry. It just untaps an artifact or a creature. Oh, never mind. You don't even know what these cards do, and you're trying to tell me to take cards that you don't even know what they do. Well, he does look like a little cutie though. Solid as a rock. <laughs> We had side rays rain and big old fat rain. You know what movie that's from? Let me take a shot in the dark. Is it Forrest Gump? No. Then it has to be Jurassic Park. Wow, I like that you were just naming movies that I... <laughs> that you frequently quote. Yeah, like, well, it was what? Forrest Gump, yes. It was? Okay. Yes. You were right, but you didn't even know you were right, and that makes me sad. It doesn't matter. You, t you asked me to tell you what it was, and I told you. Stolen by the Fae is real good. Did you know that? Did you know that? Did you know mm -hmm. this card's real good? Turn dark creature in for a man. That's pretty good, yeah. Yeah. You might say this card is uh, solid as rock. Have you ever considered no. going to the store and just buying, buying K-Cups? Every once in a while. Consider it. What do you, what's the reason that you don't? Uh, I should have bought some at Sam's Club when I was there yesterday. Oh, but you didn't. Yeah, they got good deals. Solid there. as a lock. And sometimes it seemed like the rain came from underneath. I'm tempted to just cut the green here and just play this guy, but I don't think that's good. Really? I don't know, dude. Trapped in the tower is also very good. Trapped in a tower. Oh, out muscle. All right, now I'm feeling better about my choice because the blue cards are not impressive here, but out muscle is top tier, especially with two. I guess that doesn't really do anything. Oh, once in future again. This pack is pretty rough. Solid as a mop. Solid as a mop. Huh? What? Oh shit! Is this any any uh, other creatures you control? Any creature? Yeah, and this is creatures you control. Oh baby, yeah, we're definitely double O cam rangering. Ooh, another Ard Arden Vale tactician. All right, our deck's looking sweet, guys. Our deck is looking solid as a rock. This guy's good too. Barter cow GTFO. Sorcerer's Broom, how many things do we have to sacrifice? Eh, not too much, huh? Like literal nothing. Sometimes you gotta win without Oko. I don't I don't like that though. Oh, it's fairy guide, Mother Michael. Oh, I don't know. So it is. Good lord. How many fairy guide mothers is too many? I'm glad you're back in the stream. Always fun. You 
chewing <laughs> you there in the back chewing ice and saying my dad when other people are there i automatically go what kind of mic is that yeah that's pretty normal that's pretty standard that's uh that's standard mic technology that's the expected behavior <laughs> it all checks out can we open a garrick in the next pack that'd be sweet i'd splash for that i'd splash for that i'd splash for that what felipe's making something that smells real good it smells like waffles it smells like breakfast for sure or toast any food smells good right now though Did you say any food smells good? Yeah. Is that because you woke up at 5 p.m. and you haven't eaten yet? Maybe. Okay. Solid as a rock. I just made some sloppy Joseph's. Wow. The full name, huh? Oh, sloppy Joseph's Magnetic Snowy thank you so much for the sub really appreciate it welcome welcome man you gonna play those little good piggy boys nah dude but you have a bunch of things that pump your team maybe then maybe Michael maybe I'll put them in here look they're in there now okay does that make you happy it does Jesus get that MTG bot crap chain what is that oh yeah my bad you're right happily ever after that's not an oko this pack's pretty bad. This pack's actually just trash. All right. Each player gains five and draws a card. At the beginning of your upkeep, if there are five colors among permanents you control, that's too hard. If there are six or more card types on permanents you control and or cards in your graveyard and your life total is greater than the... Nope, I'm out. I always want to double check that and be like, are we sure we can't do this? And the answer is like, yeah, you can't. Take the Brute... What? I'm just going to take Scalding Cauldron because I think that's probably better. I don't think Brute's very good. I don't know why you guys are all brooting it up. Brute, 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 brute it up. Brute, 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 brute it up. Brute, like, brute, brute. Are you done? Yes. I do like a prized Griffin. Griffin. Man, that's uh, a goose. Prized Peter Griffin. All right, third pick Oko. You ready? It's just a goose, man. Goose man. Goose man. Take me take by goose me. hand. Okay. I will. Oh. Oh, that's a nice one. That's exciting. In our deck, it's only a 2-2 two, two for 2, but nonetheless, like, it still adds 2 mana. 2-2 two, two for 3? Yeah, that's what I meant. But it still ramps 2, which is real nice. Ramps 2. They used to call me old ramps, old Uncle Ramps too. Uh, giant opportunity. Do we have enough food to make two giants? I don't think so. Or one giant. Do we have enough food to sacrifice two foods to make a giant? How oh. many food you gotta sack? Two food to make one giant, otherwise you get three food. I think it's just fierce witch chocolate. This guy's just really good. I'll just take the once in future out. Actually, this card's real good. I like this card a what lot. What does that card even do? Return a card from your graveyard to your hand and put one card from your graveyard on top of your library. However, if you play three, if you use three green to cast it, you return both of them to your hand. Okay. That's solid. Solid as a rock. So it's basically like draw two from your graveyard, which is nice if you have like out muscle or either one of these guys or. Solid. You gonna play that? Oh, uh, I mean, I gotta cut something. I guess I can cut one fairy guide mother. Yeah, that, the the other one seems better. It kills a thing. Does it? Yeah. Does it? It's a lot of things with three toughness. What if he face off against Oko and he makes a 3-3? Three, three? Flaxen Intruder! Oh yeah, that's nice. You know what this card does? Make some TGs. How did you know that? Because that was like one of the first cards spoiled. Oh my god. Oh man. Triple OK Oof. Ranger? Alright. I'm game. My bones are cracking. Your bones are cracking? 
Yeah. But at least Mike's bones. Remember the time I was really sad I couldn't get these guys and then I got three of them in the same deck? I remember. You know who else remembers? Jesus. No, dude. Pepperidge Farm. God. So Jesus. You think Jesus is Pepperidge Farm? You don't. So I thought. Solid as a rock. I'm just going to take... Oh, I'll just take that rare. Sure. Sure. You know what? Sure. You take it. You see us. I don't care. What? Sewers, I don't care. Se sewers, I don't care? What? I have literally no idea what you're saying right now. I think you're... <laughs> Solid as a rockland. I'm gonna. I don't want to get political here. I really don't. But this is the most comical shit I've ever seen. Apparently, the White House has had to confirm this is a real letter. Dear Mr. President, this is from Trump to the President of uh, Turkey, I believe. Yes, President of the Republic of Turkey. All right, hold on. True love's kiss is nice. You ready? Let's work out a good deal. You don't want to be responsible for slaughtering thousands of people. And I don't want to be responsible for destroying the Turkish economy. And I will. I've already given you a little sample with respect to Pastor Brunson. I've worked hard to solve some of your problems. Don't let the world down. You can make a great deal. General Moslem is willing to negotiate with you, and he is willing to make concessions that they would never have made in the past. I am confidentially enclosing a copy of his letter to me, just received. History will look upon you favorably if you get this done in the right and humane way. It will look upon you forever as the devil if good things don't happen. Don't be a tough guy. Don't be a fool. I will call you later. <laughs> like, what? Oh my god, that's the most surreal thing I've ever seen. Why? Solid as a rock. Oh god. We need one cut here. Oh, True Love's Kiss. Alright, cool. Please so you, you like that card. True Love's Kiss? I do for the sideboard. It exiles an enchantment or an artifact, bro. What if there's those in the main, bro? Oh, well, I'll just, I'll just, I'll deal with I guess that. Guess you'll die. Don't be a fool, Michael. Don't be a, don't be a tough guy, okay? It's probably main deck. I mean, Return to Nature is more main deckable, but I like everything else in my main deck is probably more main deckable. That's what I would, that's what I would say to you. Nine eight seems all right. Nine eight, that seems great. That letter must be like, like no wait. My friend is like the White House had to officially confirm that this is real. Like they're like, hey man, is this a is this a joke? Like people thought it was a meme. Like someone just made it as like a as like to make fun of Trump, but like it's actually like that's something, dude. Okay, so this one isn't real. This is one my friend Nick sent me. Uh, it might be real, actually. Dear Mr. President, we can change the world tomorrow. This could be a better place. If you don't like what I'm saying, then won't you slap my face? Because I'm bad. I'm bad. Come on. You know I'm bad. I'm bad. Come on. You know. You know I'm bad. I'm bad. Come on. You know. And the whole world has to answer right now. Just to tell you once again, who's bad? I will call you later. Those are the lyrics to uh, Michael Jackson's bad, in case you guys didn't know. And that's okay. Michael, let me tell you right now who's bad. Okay. It's you. Hmm. Got him. Did you see me get him? Did you guys witness it? I'm going to play some treats to share. Oh, treats to share. Michael B. Living... 
in the trees. <laughs> Would you rather live in the tree or under the sea? Probably the tree. Because hmm. I can't breathe the water. What if you could? Then probably the sea. It's really dependent on that, though. Huh. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. Why can you swim underwater? I, I can't, personally. You can't? No, I can. Okay. I'll lie to you. I believe Mike only likes garbage water that's true that is his favorite favorite drink favorite well we pollute so much in the ocean pretty much the whole thing is garbage water yeah all you have to do is drink literally out of the out of the ocean and you're drinking garbage water did you ever know that you're Mike's hero you're everything Michael, Michael B. What's the difference in garbage water and trash juice? The five carry the one. Did I detect a niner in there? Or are you dialing from a walkie talkie? <laughs> <laughs> huh, that's pretty good. I wish that guy had haste. Haste it up. This is Michael B. He lives in a trash can. Do -do 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 Garbage water doesn't have the delicious wow. Michael Michael likes his precious garbage water with the delicious. Michael, I likes the precious delicious garbage water. Oh dear. Man, nope. I'm gonna run out of time. You're gonna run out of time? Yeah. For what? For foods. I thought you said you had to be there at like nine ten. Nine thirty. But then you said you can be late. Yeah, I could probably be there by 10. Just get there at 11. Okay, well, that's unreasonable. Like, blocking here seems bad, so I'm just going to not do it. That's my job. We need to talk about your Smeagol impression. It wasn't good, man. I, I, I know. I understand. Let's play this guy first. Just won my ranger draft. Turns out busted mythic rares are busted. Yeah, considering that I just won mine with a uh, card called Oko, Thief of Thief of Dreams. I don't think that's what, is that what his name is. Thief of is it Thief of Dreams? Is that what it's called? Is it Thief of Dreams? Is that what it's called? You, had, you contribute nothing. I contribute everything, buddy. Nothing. You're a liar. Nothing. Thief of crowns. See? Nailed it. See? I nailed it. What's wrong with you? I believe it is Oko no Joko. That's true. That is the official, official name. Really? Rude. The heat is my Michael B. Michael B. Where did that other food come from? Oh, the, the treats to share. Dang it, MTG Bot is still busted. Cardoco, <laughs> no Joko. Good times. God, why didn't that work? I mean, 100% blocking if you want to use a trick on your turn. That's totally fine, my dude. Schmickle Schmolus? Schmickle Schmolus? Oh, wow, that guy's so tiny. Yeah. 
You okay? You guys chatting? You guys having a little little tay da tay? You're gonna mill us for eight? What the fuck? What is this deck I'm seeing? Oh, got another one. Alright, that's actually not the worst mill, I guess. Got another one? Oh, you're just gonna play Tome Raider, sure. The heat is on. Michael, did you know that the heat was on? You should really turn the heat off because it's you're probably gonna spend a lot of money on electricity. Pizza, 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 pie, pie. Pizza pie. What? We're just singing about pizza pies. What a stupid song. Why is it stupid? You're stupid. I know. <laughs> Can't cry. I was crying. Look, oh, we did a God, thing. That's annoying. Wow, that's really obnoxious. Guess I'm taking five little damage. I don't like anything that's happening right now. Alright, third time's a charm. I would actually like some lands here so I can play more than one spell a turn, but... I like that. I like Pizza Song. I enjoyed that song. Had a great message. <laughs> Wow. Oh my god, seriously? can't get behind anything right now like I'm just so far behind because I can't fucking keep a dude on the board and also not die like at any point if I get to actually be proactive and kill his guy like we just can't lose but instead we're losing to mono so tinies Mana cost three or less, huh? Nope, doesn't do anything. Two, 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 two. Also, we can't even play this and still rally for the life gain. It's kind of annoying. We can't even block this, so like we're just basically dead to it, actually. Unless we specifically rally, but. Why don't you go turn it off? A oh, good, uh, good point. I got a uh, good point. I got a uh, uh, good point. I don't know why, why, why we're friends. Why, why, why we're friends? I don't know why, why, why we're friends. I don't Man, know you why. Should get a, uh, you should get a windshield wiper for your window. A windshield wiper for my window? Yeah. Yeah, because it gets all moist. Yeah. M -m 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 moist. You like that? Not really. So you say you loved it? <laughs> no. Loves it. In Italy, houses are made of pizza and fountains are filled with garlic water? I'm, I'm moving. <laughs> Why would you want your house to be made of pizza? Because it's delicious, Michael. You can't eat your house, then you have nowhere to live. Maybe you can't. 
Garlic water. Gross. <laughs> Gross? Garlic water would not be good, man. That's not the flavor I want in my water. You're not drinking it because you want water water. You're drinking it because it's delicious garlic water. That doesn't make any sense. Buddy, you're a damn fool. <laughs> what if it's garlic butter sauce in the fountains? Oh, God. I'll drown in it. <laughs> He'll be like, what happened to Frank? He'll be like, he drowned in the garlic water fountain. Sweet. I didn't want to land and I don't care about that silver flame idiot. Mike just needs to travel more to understand. It's true. Garlic water, so pickle brine? Huh. I mean, it's only 7 o'clock now, man. We got three hours. Yeah, I got to drive there and stuff too, though. Yeah, I got to drive there. I got I to got hold vehicle. I got to get my vehicle and drive to the place where I'm going. Wow. 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 We don't have to go, man. I'll go I'll go by myself. Do you ever think about that? It's just a time thing. I mean it happens. What happens, man? The time is a thing and the time right. happens? Time happens, yeah, man. Just time happens, okay? <sighs> time freaking happens. You sound like a scientist. Oh. What is what a scientist. What a time scientist. We didn't see any pump spells out of them. We only saw two so tinies. So. I ain't blocking this guy. Would you ever want to travel to foggy London town and eat some bread pudding with the football hooligans? Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay, so Paladin, Giant Killer, Flaxen, Glass Casket. That was a really good hit. like three of our best cards yeah that's real sad the mic bees on do 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 I guess I should have attacked first there oh man I totally forgot he had vigilance I need to get my head in this game I need to get my bearings straight Oh, 3-3, three, three, huh? So you definitely have Insatiable Hunger in hand, right? Like, that's not... I'm not being crazy here, right? It's actually surprisingly hard to deal with. Especially if you're playing that guy post-combat. What would you do for a Klondike bar? Oh, nothing. I'm good, thank you. I appreciate the offer. Okay. What would you do for a Michael B? Anything. You could do anything? Yeah. I think you would do literally nothing for a Michael B. But that's me. Correct. You would do nothing for yourself, is what I'm saying. Wow. Yeah. I'd okay. That's a little. That's a little extreme. They're not really that expensive. I'd eat a pizza house for a Mike B. Wow. You'd do that for yourself. I feel like a pizza house might not be very sturdy. I don't think a pizza house would be very sturdy. I don't feel like you're very sturdy, so I guess that's 
wow. that's life you know god trip my soul out yeah I don't really care about your soul that much I'll be honest g -g 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 got him Is a pizza house a house made of pizza or a house containing only pizza? Hmm. Yes. The answer is yes. Don't you remember you told me a Michael Bead? Okay. No. Yeah, put the 04 on the 3 3. That seems like a better block. There you go. Put the 1 3 on the 2 2. There you go. And then just take 7. Oh, okay. Can't tell if this guy's dead or not, or if they got a crazy, wacky, insatiable hunger. Crazy. Oh, that. No. Alright. Sure. None of your Michael B's wax. I would be homeless real fast as well. And Mike doesn't understand that. He's like, why would you want to live in the house? I'm like, Michael, have you tasted pizza before? Because then you just get to eat it. You get to eat your house. And that's kind of a big deal. Is it? You don't You don't know? Is the cheese on the inside or the outside of the house? Exactly. You like leaves on your cheese? That's not good. Leaves on your cheese, leaves, leaves on your cheese. Are you still seven in the air here? I think we're gonna put it on this dude instead. Oh, the weather outside is frightful. Fire is so demackful. I mean, if they want to just double block here, that's fine. I'll trade one for one. I mean, I'm hoping their last card is not run away together, I guess. And they do want to do that. And then this guy just gets eaten. Sure. Let it snow, let it snow, Michael B. I keep checking my messages to see what my poker group is saying to me. Oh, they just drew four cards. It's a lot. But can it save you? But can you see why kids love the taste of Cinnamon Toast Crunch? Pizza the Hut is one of the greatest villains ever, and the reason is because he's delicious. That's from that's from the movie. If there's no place to go, bounce a thing. Yep, and then they had it. Sure. Interesting. Boy, I tell you what. You can Michael B. Michael B. Mm-hmm. 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 
I believe my B is our future. Find me and let him lead the way. Look at all this food I'm making. Toppings are just pizza accessories. That's true. Alright, you can scry too. You can scry if you want to. You can leave Mike B behind. Because if Mike B, Michael B, Michael B's left behind. Let's get in there for one. Man, this fairy grand fairy guard guide mother is really just doing some business here. It's doing less business now. Oh So next turn if we hit a land we can go Ranger into Ranger, double Ranger. They did nothing? You okay over there? Yeah. You sure? I had to do pizza science. What does that even mean? I just had to Google a pizza place and provide a link to somebody, that's all. Couldn't they do that themselves? No, they wouldn't be able to figure it out. <laughs> wow, you just said they're real dumb. Because well, the pizza place... The pizza place used to be a West Shore pizza, but it's no longer West Shore pizza. It's called Pizza by the, the Berg, but it's basically the same restaurant. But if you just type in Pizza by the Slice, it's a Pizza really show by up. the Berg. Solid as a rock. We won. <laughs> Should never told you about that song. Why not? Now all you do is sing it. I would say I'm pretty solid as a rock. What does that mean? You know what it means. Oh, God. I like Trapped in the Tower a lot less when they have their, um, when they have, like, run, run from the demon. Run from the devil. Running from the devil. Solid as a rock. I also wish you never got this song stuck in my head. Well, maybe if you weren't so stupid. Really? Yeah. You think that would have made a difference? I think so, yeah. Wow. 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 No. Don't like that. It's <laughs> a great new addition. Oh, I like this hand. That's what Father likes. Oh, do they go to six? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it down. Take it down to six down. Take it, take it down to six down. Jesus, take your, get your life together, man. My life's together just fine. It's definitely not. <laughs> Look, because I just did the shaky mouth? Yeah, that's why. That's the reason. Okay. Also, no. Also, no. What? 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 Huh? Not a Tomb Raider. It's like Tomb Raider, only, you know, different. hand is very slow and they're playing a bunch of dirtily dudes I 
I guess we take three here and I'll try to just kill this Garen Brig Squire after. I don't want them to have like plus two, plus two, or plus three, plus three, and then just blow us out. Sure. Eh, okay. Oh, look, they had it. They always do. They never don't. Never don't have it. Oh, lucky clover. So lucky. Much clover. Wow. Land. Give me a land. Land, 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 This game is really grindy. Did you know that? Oh, I know that. Okay. Our opponent really likes to tank on all of his turns. I think that's what's making it take so long. It's true. Yours is so tiny. Hmm. God, this Garenberg Carver is not even that good. You have like 30 of them? I mean, it's been pretty good against us. Has it, though? Yes. Has it? It's killed, like, several of our things. Did it? Yeah. Mm. Oh, God, they're gonna... They're gonna run, because they have two cards, and one of them is... Run away together, so they're gonna bounce our guy. Yep, they never. Jesus, come on. That's annoying. And if we had any sort of lands on turn six, then we could have actually either returned to nature in response and then still killed it, but. How about a land for this bird? Nope. I'm asking too much. This guy and this guy. They know they can cast these guys, right? I don't think they do know that. I don't think they know either. Well, they found out. We found Hack. out. What? Hack. What? Just providing noises for the oh, arts. That's, that's cool. Because it's clearly a goose. No. Oh. I mean, it's not... Mm. It's got a goose mouth. Which is what, a beak? Yeah. I guess you're right. I guess it has a goose mouth. Is it going to trade? Oh, wow. That's fine. Your guy costs four, mine costs two. Oh, God, seriously? I'm going to pass because next turn we can giant killer one of these guys. Which 
which seems very, very good. We can also squire it. Land. I just want to land here. Okay. Well, that'll do at one point. Well, we can only play return. Yeah, this is actually fine. We can actually return this to make a 2-4, block their 3-2. That's actually okay if they don't have anything busted here. No nah, man, that guy's getting eaten. Solid as a rock. I'm just gonna eat this now. That seems pretty good actually. Alright, I feel like we're in a better position now. Okay, so that's fine. I'll take one. I think we win this race. You okay, man? Huh? Are you just are you literally are you are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, you just weren't saying anything. Didn't th couldn't think of any funnies recently, you know? And no teehees? No teehees, yeah. That's a bummer, dude. Man, I've been there, dude. No teehees? The summer of no teehees? It's the worst summer of my life. I'll never forget it. <laughs> you play nothing? No, I'm going to tap their team down and keep up Giant Killer. I am a Giant Killer. Solid as a rock. What about some girly giggles? <laughs> you sound like Peter Griffin. You sound like Peter Griffin when he was doing the girly laugh. Hmm. Solid as a rock. So we're taking five, six, seven, eight here. I assume they're gonna bounce their their dude and our dude. Oh, they're just gonna gain three. Okay, that's fine. No bouncing yet, huh? Okay. Still got to keep a squire and giant killer. All right, so we're doing it. I think our I think our deck just won, but you know it's hard to say because magic is a tough game. Nope, we won. It was easier to say. Hey, look I at thought. that! What a spicy meatball! Uh. I got your spicy meatball right here, my dude. You do? Can I have it? No, it's too late. It's already. Oh, man. I already ate it. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry because you deserved it. Got him. Got him. If you see me, got him. I got him so much, Charles. Uh, Who's Charles? I don't know. Are you man. talking to Charles Xavier? <laughs> yeah. You should have got him when you had the chance, Charles. You alright, man? Yeah. You think you're fucking dying, dude. Why? Because you're literally not saying anything. You're just sitting here like this. And your eyes are I said something. Then. We just had a meatball exchange. Oh, me oh, the meatball exchange. That's actually the name of my hardcore band. Solid as Mike B. How's it going, Mike? My KSB. Going pretty good. Is it? Yeah. What's your favorite day of the week? I guess Tuesday. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> why does that make me stupid? I can't tell you why things are the well, way I they are. Tell you what <laughs> Did you just have a stroke? <laughs> several. You had several strokes? Yeah, man. Oh, my God. Sunday, chicken Sunday. Did you guys see the meatball exchanges touring? Have fun and play well. I'm like, I'll for sure do one of those.
What is Meatball Exchange? That's the name of my hardcore band. The Meatball Exchange. Yeah, the opening band is always Mayo on Top. That's who we're touring with right now. Meatball Exchange and Mayo on Top. See you this Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. It's not a monster truck rally, man. I'm, yeah, you're right. That was a monster <laughs> truck thing. <laughs> oh, look at this cat. Kitty cat. I was excited for a real cat. I was excited for nothing. That's sad. Clear eyes, chicken Sundays can't lose. <laughs> oh, good lord. I'll take one from this kitty cat. God, I got a two drop, too? No, oh, that's not really a two drop. That's kind of like a fake. Every meatball two exchange drop. I ever went to had a meat monster truck. Wow. Yeah, but you're probably more of a. You're probably more of a savvy meatball exchange uh, attendee than we are. I'm a meatball exchange cover band called Pepper Jack Cheese. Wow. <laughs> Chat oh, is God. great. The memes are so real. All right, so that's good. All right. I would have loved to land here because this guy would have just been gas on top of the furnace. Oven. Gas on top of the furnace. I got my little gassy on the furnace. You got your oh, gassy, gassy on the furnace. What are you saying right now? You're actually a disgusting individual. I'm surprised you've made it this long in your life, to be quite honest. Me too, man. <laughs> it's been a real ride. Every day I wake up and I'm like, Mike dead yet? Nope, oh, another day, huh? Good for you. Good for you. He's on a record. You should have your play metal band. You should have your play metal band play on the back of a monster truck while it's stomping. I should... Did you? I think you had one too many plays in there, right? That's the problem, right? Yeah, you just cut out that one play and you're good to go. Quit farting on the funeral, Mitch. <laughs> farting on the funeral is also an my said emo quit band. Quit farting on the furnace, Mitch. Oh, that not makes funeral. <laughs> that just made sense. funeral up. <laughs> I, did, I did make. I did make funeral up. Farting on the furnace is also a solid indie, indie name, so I don't. Solid as a rock. No. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> land, 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 land. Yes. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna need you to calm down, sir. No. Hey, man, quit farting on the funeral, all right? And they're going to be like, what does that mean? You're going to be like, it's a saying. You've never heard quit farting on the funeral? And you can just spread it and we'll see how that far it goes. sounds like it's like, you know, stop making me have a bad time. Like, you know, quit farting on my funeral. But funerals aren't really a good time, so it doesn't really make sense. Solid as a Oh, my God. I hate you so much. <laughs> you got it stuck in my head, man. Just listen to something else, man. God. I listen to everything every day. You're not even singing it right. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Michael, however I choose to sing it is the right way to sing it. You understand? Dude, quick farting on my funeral, all right? <laughs> Perfectly timed. I'll give you that. Unbelievable. Are you a practicing Jew? No. I perfected it. I perfected it. <laughs> God, Paul Rudd's a legend. Do you like do what do you like doing better? Uh Marvel movies or movies where no one remembers you? Definitely Marvel movies. <laughs> oh man. Solid like a rock. Do they just God, everyone forever young is just a filter. They're just like I'll cycle. Okay, okay. Okay, Meng. I guess we just play this guy, because, God lord, he's so good. Today's guest is Santa Claus on meth. Or we just play this bird. Honk. I like old Honkerton. The 3 4 flyer, man, that's a big boy. It's a fat boy? I'm waiting until we have another green to play this guy. I am Dude Man. 
Fart on the furnace is gas. That's perfect right there. Because it's furnace. So it's... Oh, God, they're going <laughs> to... Oh, God. I'll get rid of these two so that when they cast that guy, I can still kill it. I don't really care about this guy. I, I, don't, I don't love getting rid of this guy, but... So... I've got some treats to share, Michael B. How's your yawn? Pretty good. That's cool, man. It's like farting on a funeral. It's a free ride when you already farted on a funeral. It's not good. And who would have thought Michael B's? It's Michael B's. Every day. Michael B. It's Michael B. Today. What they just play? Yes. Excellent. I'm gonna chop that dude down so fast. Get chopped down, everybody. You all, everybody. Remember that song from Lost? Oh, I do. Do you? Yes. Do you? Yes. Do you? Yes. Yes. Okay. My man. And who would have thought it's Mike butter? Bobby Butters was afraid to fly. I'm in this game. I just said that. Packed his suitcase with unsalted butter tonight. <laughs> Why? Who eats unsalted butter? You gotta get the salted butter, right? Not when you're cooking. What? When you're cooking, you want to use unsalted butter. Why? Because you add salt to taste as you're making the food. So it doesn't become too salty. I'll just add the butter, bro. Oh my god. Such an amateur. Excuse me? You heard me. You don't even cook, man. I cook stuff sometimes. What, have you ever cooked hot dogs? Wow. I don't even think I've ever cooked hot dogs. You just literally, you make pasta and that's it. And you make jar sauce. That's the things you cook, man. I've made my own sauce before. Oh, did you? Yeah. When was it? Back in 19 dickety two? Basically, yeah. Oh, back before the war? Yeah, before the war, man. It was a rough time, you know. No way, man. Salt it up. Salt or die. That's my... See, look, the chat agrees with me. See, look, yeah, unsalted butter for sure, unsalted for sauces and glazes, unsalted for baking, unsalted always. Then what's the? Why don't I just add? Why don't I just use salted butter and just add a little less of my own salt? Because you ne you can, you you can't control if you put too much butter, you might be over salt. That's never it. happened to me in my life. <laughs> I guess unsalted butter should only be used to put on bread when you're like just eating butter and bread. Yeah, well, salted butter's for toast, yeah. Exactly. What the fuck is over-salting? Thank you. Thank you. I ain't never been like, there's too much salt in this. I should have gotten unsalted it's just, that's butter. That's because you're a salt fiend. No, it's because I'm not a little salt bitch. No, you're you're an over-salter. How dare you? And who would have thought... Mike's fingers. What? Huh? What? 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 Huh? What? 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 What is this video? <laughs> Down here, salt is a way of life. <laughs> oh, I want to add that shit to the soundboard. Down here, salt is a way of life. <laughs> See, that's funny. See, that's some kind of comedy right there. 
Eats the crumbs at the bottom of the pretzel bag. Oh, dude, I, I totally do, dude. I also think the bottom of the bag of, like, chips or Doritos or whatever, those are the most flavorful crumbs ever because they're all, like, super high concentration of salt. Uh, and spices. Like, all the spices are down there, man. Oh, you're just going to kill that dude. Well, that's real mature. You're like a child. You're a child trapped in a, in a cauldron. Is that a thing? What? <laughs> What? I blacked out. Oh, is this something about a cauldron? Yeah, just talking about your children. My children? Yeah, man. What children? I got no children. Then who did I kidnap? <laughs> oh no! They should just sell a bag of crumbs. I'm always like, how come these Dorito crumbs on the bottom of the bag have such a high concentration of flavor? And then the rest don't. How does it get this way? Are you like... You ever chase your real food with chips? Is that it's a... Like, it's like when you eat a sandwich, you mean? You mean a sandy? No. Oh, do you mean I a, mean a sandy? goddamn sandwich. Okay, just stop. I hope they block. They won't, but I hope they do. They won't, but I hope they do. Yeah, this is a fishy attack if I've ever it's, seen one. It's real fishy. And you're not winning in the race? 100% take it. Goodbye. I mean, they obviously want me to kill this more than something else, so I'll do it. I'll bite. I'll do it. I'll do it. Don't say you're not gonna. I'll do it. I heard Zach's where it's like the pudding skins idea. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or the muffin tops. Seinfeld has a bunch of episodes where they're like, let's focus on the best part of this object and, uh, and sell that I've specifically. I've never seen the pudding skins episode. Well, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Just keep taking it. Take the damage. Take take the damage. I should have actually done this this turn, and then I can next turn, and then I can just play it this turn next to Rick Muscle, but... Don't you think? I had a link above you would be interested in. Oh, God, I'm probably not. <laughs> oh the old lonesome road farting on a funeral that's pretty good yeah that's one of my favorite bands actually farting on a funeral hey man don't fart on the funeral okay god I gotta draw a card from this too I wish there was things I could do there's got to be a better way oh my god Dorito nacho cheese in a gun form and you can just blast it all over your food yes why doesn't it get reach? Why doesn't it have reach? These are the questions we ask ourselves. These are the questions. Solid as a rock. <sighs> what? What? What's the matter, man? <laughs> Solid as a rock, bro. This guy's gonna keep getting in there. Joke's on you. I don't even have a trick. Nah, I'm just kidding. I do. Like a free ride when you already mic bead. And who would have mic'd bead? I'm here. Salt is a way of life. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this for a miserable on MTGA? That I do not understand. Oh, they just get them beans. Get them beans, oh, look at them beans. Get them beans, collect them in a stew. What? what? Collect them in a stew? Yeah. What does that even mean, my <laughs> dude? Well, if you don't know, I can't tell you. Why not? I mean, they're going to definitely kill this guy in response, but... That's life, man. Mr. Play it safe. Afraid to fly. That's right. He was afraid to fly. Dude, that guy packed his suitcase. And then he kissed his kids goodbye. <laughs> that dude waited his whole damn life, Mike, to take that flight, dude.
Yeah, that's true because there's no because the bots don't know to prioritize the mill cards or like even have a mill strategy. So I guess you just kind of like draft against a million mill decks. Oh, they just hard cast that guy without making me discard the two cards in my hand. That's an interesting choice. What? I guess the faster clock, but still a little weird. Yeah, but then you could have kept, like, removal spell up. So now I don't get to do this. And now I get to do this. And now this guy, uh, whenever it attacks, it gets flying. So, like, it, it'll never be able to profitably attack. So that was pretty good for us. Solid as a rock. Rock. Who is your favorite, Mike, who is your favorite recurring character on Seinfeld? I've only seen like 10 episodes of Seinfeld, so. <laughs> Don't ride, rub your head like you didn't already know that. Just because I knew it doesn't mean it doesn't hurt every time I'm reminded of it. It's like <laughs> saying, hey, you knew your mom passed away. Why do you rub your head every time I talk about it? Because it still hurts. I don't know if that's on the same level, man. Don't you tell me. Look. Look. Look at all these people disappointed in you. Just like your father. <laughs> God, this is nine damage right here. That's pretty scary. My favorite is probably David Putty. I can't answer a question I don't know the answer to. Then you make the answer. Make it, Michael. Make it, Michael. Michael is a dude. Michael Everett. Okay, Councilman Jam is not from Seinfeld. That's <laughs> literally like that is Parks and Rec. <laughs> oh, he did the Kappa face. All right, fair enough. It's a tiny Kappa face. Uh, Mark, I've answered this like three times, but you weren't here. Um, I play the Eldraine drafts on Magic Online because they're quicker. They're always three rounds. I get to play all three rounds, and it doesn't go to like. What if I have like four wins and one loss and then I'm still playing that sixth round on Arena and it takes like two and a half hours? Every draft on Magic Online usually takes like an hour and a half at most. And it's a lot easier for content. And like people said, like the bots don't really seem to be that... It's not as competitive. One, two, three, four, five. I think I just want Wolfstalker and Flaxen Intruder here. Like the flight doesn't really matter. Oh, they're just going to gain a life. Oh, that's great for us. I was afraid they were going to All right, just... Mike, let's try something more your speed. What's your favorite recurring char movie character in the movie Space Jam? Are there are recurring characters in that movie? I don't even know if that makes sense for that. Yeah, how can you have recurring characters in a movie? If you're just asking what my favorite character from Space Jam is. You know, the guy who's in all the, all the Space Jam movies. I'd go with Bugs Bunny if I had to pick a character. Over Michael Jordan? Yeah. Did you know Michael Jordan was in the movie? Did you know he's also a giant scumbag in real life? I don't know. I don't know if I go so far as to call him a scumbag. I think he's probably a little short. I think he's probably pretty short. I've he's I've heard stories that he's kind of like a jerk. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, Bill Murray was in that. Hmm. That's fair. Solid as a mic. Oh, wow. What do they have? Oh, nothing.
You okay, man? Just sighing, man. Yeah, but people usually sigh when they're like exasperated or disappointed or just, you know, man, you just sound Sometimes you sigh just naturally. It has nothing to do with that. What? It's just like a release. Really? Yeah. Is that true? It doesn't have to mean anything. Get out of here. Not like sad or anything. Michael, get out of here. <laughs> Michael, leave. Call the police. Call the police. <laughs> do you have any rubber walrus protectors? Oh, that's that's fascinating. Give me the goose. Give me the goose. No. Why not? I'm not going to do that. You want me to give you the goose? No one wants you to give anybody a goose. You don't know that. Michael, we You're know. Not part of my Michael, we know. You're not part of my goose life. Do you God. ever see that? You ever see that on TV show, My Sweet Goose Life? Yeah, it's my favorite. I watch it every day. Every day. I'm definitely... I don't think we. I don't think it's worth sacrificing this to kill a food, but maybe it is. Oh, it's not. We still have to target it so they can just sack it in response. That's pretty bad. Oh god! I thought it just destroyed it. I thought the trigger on the stack meant that like I didn't have to like also wait for the the resolve. Yeah, that's stupid. That was terrible. So. Mucho, we don't need to hear about your releases. <laughs> it's true. He's right. Oh, wow. Well, when you put it like that. I think we're winning this game. Surprisingly. What? I thought yeah. we were yeah, behind dude. for a really long time. Yeah, dude, I'll block. If you, if you have a uh, last-ditch pump spell, it's fine. Insatiable hunger, sack the food. Excellent. Pretty good last card. Oh, I guess they don't have to sack the food. They could just not sack the food. That's fine. They have no cards in hand. We have four damage and they're at five. That was a weird a weird attack there, but I guess what else are you gonna do, you know? Did you hear that car goodbye? Did you hear that horn, Michael? Did you hear that horn, Michael? <laughs> I like that instead of answering, you just literally just repeated the question to me. Yes, I did hear the horn, okay? God. Did you hear that uh, everything was solid as a rock? Solid as a rock. <laughs> fucking strangle you to death. With rocks. You're going to strangle me with rocks? Yeah. Guys, can you... Have you ever heard of someone strangling someone else with rocks? I'll take two rocks and just... Shake them? You're going to shake them? Yeah, that's that's what I was I'm doing. I'm just going to shake the rocks a little bit. All right, well, you do you, man. Hey, man, if this match is quick, were we still going to get food or... I did order a pizza with somebody, but I'm still down to eat. Oh, fucking there. <laughs> He's like, but I'll have... So yesterday, Mike was... Uh, Mike got some uh, Chipotle... Hold on, let me. Fuck, I wish these. I wish these filters didn't keep changing. Just means I'll have to not. I look like a friggin' game. tomato, dude. It's because of me. I always bring the redness for some reason. That's better. So Michael got uh, what was it? It's like a steak bowl from Chipotle. Uh, yeah, because they're out of chicken. And they got a bunch of tortillas with it. So you actually, can make it was barbacoa. Little... Oh, barbacoa. Double double barbacoa. And then like five hours later, he's like, I need to go to McDonald's, make a chicken McNugget run. And then he gets 24 chicken McNuggets and a large fries. <laughs> Just real casual. Like, oh, when you put it like, like that, it smack. makes me sound kind of bad. I don't understand. That's correct. <laughs> I thought Mike was going to cook something with unsalt. No, Mike would have to actually cook something that uses butter. Or more ingredients than a box of pasta, jar of sauce. Hey, man. Yeah, man? I use meat and seasonings, okay? Meat and seasonings? Yeah. What kind of seasonings do you use? Italian Salt, seasoning. Salt, pepper. Oh, really? So a little garlic. 
Oh, a little garlic. So last time I streamed, I had a tiny pre-zit spot on the top of my nose, and no matter what I do with the camera and lighting, I look like freaking Rudolph. It was terrible. Dude, the pre-zits that you can't do anything with, you're like, well, I can't pop this, and it's painful. I guess this is my life. Yeah, those suck. Those are the absolute Also, worst. I use a little onion powder. Ooh. Why don't you just oregano. put a real onion in there? It's different. When you plainly state the facts, it makes me sound bad. God, I sound really fat when you lay it all out like that. Oh, Kerwood's here. I didn't know he was here. Really? You didn't know he was here? Because he's been here the whole time. Really? Yeah. I haven't seen him chat much. Oh, you haven't seen him chat very much. Oh, well, Michael. Little Michael hasn't seen Kerwood in the chat. <sighs> oh. He just killed that guy. That's really sad. Can I get a three drop something? Oh, that was great. That was, that was exactly what I wanted. Are you okay? You sounded like you were getting real frustrated. What did they play? They played Scorching Dragon Fire. Hmm. You'll get caught up in the dragon fire. So the point is, Mike's dinner last night in, the, in a, in a five-hour time period was 24 chicken McNuggets, a large fry, and a barbacoa bowl from Chipotle with some tortillas on the side. Double barbacoa. Okay, because of course. Well, if you're going to make it sound ridiculous, you might as well up might it as well, all the way. You might as, well be, you might as well be accurate with it. Yeah. You want to know how much that bowl cost me? Twelve dollars. It's thirteen something. Or it made have been fourteen. Jeez, that's like an actual entree from like Carabas. No, man. Carabas are like twenty bucks plus. Twenty bucks plus? Yeah. Twenty bucks plus. That's a song I wrote called Twenty Bucks Plus. Did you like it? Hmm. You didn't like it, did you? What? You're not even listening to me. No, not really. I was reading the chat. Funyun powder from the bottom of the bag. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a good seasoning. It sounds delicious. Beer, how, do you make his, how do you get make it green? Caught up in the. I think it's like backslash me is streaming. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> See? There you go. When are you going to stop playing MTG and record an indie album? I don't know. When I get my confidence up. I can play the drums for you. Oh god, let's see if they hit anything with this. They hit nothing. Of course they didn't. So it's literally just a one two? That seems not great. It's not great. Just had a friggin' life changing revelation thanks to Beer Man Man. Wow. Here we go. Now they're always gonna do this. This is what the, this is just their thing now. That guy's good. Your brain's got a hard candy shell. My brain? Yeah. Wow. Are you just talking? Are you talking to me? I'm oh, just making quotes. Oh, he's... Oh, he took a little night tonight. Oh, he took a little nappy baby. You like these things, I'm saying? No. You like night nappy baby? Do you like that you taught me that song, man? No. You will. Well, before when I said it, like, you didn't really sing it. You just were like, whatever. But now you're like, all out. I'm solid as a rock, bro. What do you want from me, man? Double barbacoa bowl with cheese, sour cream, beans, and rice, plus 24 nugs, around 2,000 calories. Um, you're forgetting it also had two forms of salsa. Uh, large fries from McDonald's. Large fries from McDonald's. And uh, there was also, there was like a lot of cheese. Like a lot. Also, I got a tortilla on the side with the bowl. So that's an extra couple calories there. It's definitely more than 2,000 calories. Yeah, those, those meals go up to 2,000. Although my recommended intake of calories is actually over 2,000. but That's usually with an active lifestyle, not a sedentary lifestyle where you sleep until 5, watch TV, and then watch YouTube for 8 hours in bed. Maybe. Yeah, that's 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 uh, under the impression that you're burning those calories. Is that impression <laughs> that you get... <laughs> I'm just going to play this, and I'm going to kill this. Now let's keep the white up so we can... Been close to folks who have... Yeah, it's probably closer to 3,000 calories. (sighs) 
It's also not 2,000 per meal. It's per day. That's true, yes. Oh, I've been eating 6,000 calories this whole time. Okay, man. I don't eat 6,000 calories. Let's slow down. Mm. I don't even think our meal at Maggiano's is 6,000 calories. No, of course not. That's insane. Right. But you're a pretty crazy dude, man. I got Mikey B. People always get impressed by the amount of food I eat, so I usually mimic this meme. All it's not easy to sustain this beauty, beautiful body, lol. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh God. That's an accurate meme. That's a meme I could live by for sure. That's a oh, meme I do this, live by. I think. Well, this is good. That card's pretty good when it works. They are at five, though. They are at five. Hmm. I'm really missing this guy because I could have done this or played this and not that, I guess. I like my coffee black and raw. What does that mean? Like, you eat the beans? <laughs> yeah, man. So they go block, block, block. It's not great for us. Being fat is delicious. Wow, that is a that's that is a fat a thing to say. Wow, it's not wrong though. Hmm. A block, huh? But da 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 da. Hey, Michael, and other guy. Wow. Wow. Tough crowd. All right, that's not drawing you a card, so that's okay. And we can also giant kill it when it actually activates. Giant kill it. But you know what I'm saying. Let's just alpha here. We got giant killer in hand. Solid. Uh, I wonder if I've ever had a 9,000 calorie day. It's not possible. Um, 9,000 calories is probably way more than you think it is. Here, salt is a way of life. Down here, salt is a way of life. Yes, yeah, screw this. Excellent. Got three blockers out of the way. That's all I wanted. And I get to play this guy too. Woo woo! Woody woo! I feel like we can go wide enough now that like it's not even okay. We just win. They're like, yeah, you can. <laughs> okay. I uh, believe you. No man, the line. Rock your body in time. I believe you. Do you? I used to average about six to eight calorie day per day in high school. John, that seems insane knowing how you look. I would never have thought you were a, a six to eight calorie person, dude. I was only like 120 lebs though. Wow. Lebs? You must have been playing sports <laughs> or something. Who says lebs? I do. Huh. John does also not strike me as a sports guy. Well, how do you eat six to, K, six to eight K calories a day in high school and because still manage to have only 120 He's lives? a rock star, Michael. <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. Yeah, that was funny. Yeah, that was good. Are you eating something? Are you having a snack? Michael, are you snacking right now? Yeah, man, I'm snacking. What are you snacking on? I don't Frank, know. have you considered changing your Twitch and YouTube name to the guy next to Mike B? Uh, I've considered it, and like while I think the effort, I think the uh, the results would be good, I just, I don't know if I want to put the work in. I'm like the most ineffective engine. I I did play on some sports teams, though. Okay. Wow. Us having Return to Nature and Anne when they play that is actually insane. Can I go to my draw? Turn around, bright eyes. Every now and then I fall apart. And I need your moon tonight. Mm. 
I had a banana and a blueberry almond breakfast pastry and did a lot of manual labor. Well, now I, now I should have brought both in, I guess, because that's, that's also really good. I don't think we have a way to deal with that. What does that thing do? It's the thing we literally had last game. Tap, sad, blue. Okay. okay. You can shuffle in your library, right? Your graveyard or whatever. I think we could beat that. Why would you think we couldn't beat that? What? They get to draw seven? Oh, only you draw the seven. It's not uh, each player. Okay. Yeah, we'll be fine. Oh, every time me and Mike order pizza, he always eats the whole pizza in one in one sitting. It's insane. Every time. And I'm always like, I'll have lunch for like the next two days. And he's just like, ate the whole pizza. I'm like, you know, it's not a single serving, right? Yeah, sure it is. <laughs> if it, it is, if you believe enough. A two liter of Coke is 812 calories. God, non-diet soda is insane. Yeah, because like it's eight servings of like a hundred and whatever calories like 100 calories 800 calorie servings or something really oh they're just putting a counter on that sure that's great <laughs> oh now apparently two people are going to be doing that in the poker game oh boy what doing a little really yeah do they have glaucoma no <laughs> definitely not one guy said just because he doesn't have a job, which is actually really stupid because then... How do you get a job? How do you get a job right. if you have drug testing? That's fascinating. I tend to get this out of the way, but then we can't play anything else. I guess we can go trapped and then godmother one of these dudes. For reference, cream soda is 1,082 calories in two liter. Hey, yay, yay, yay. So Coke is basically healthy. Um... Mm, not so sure. Let's slow down. Chris just sent me this. <laughs> Is this wow. really the kind of stuff that's in girls' bathrooms? That's insane. You guys are so supportive. The bottom one's pretty funny though. Yeah, that that's seems clever. less profane than most most yeah, like bathroom like, talk. Usually, it's much worse than that. If you don't not eat the whole pizza in one sitting, Italians will get mad at you. Beware of the danger, lol. Yeah, see, I'm I'm just trying to protect myself. Highway to the danger, lol. Take it right to the danger. Chop down. Hey, yeah. That's, that's right. We just hired. This might have been actually risky because if they have a spell they can play here, which they probably do. We're just waiting for it. They're trying to figure out what to do with it. Yeah, this is stupid. <coughs> Dislike. Wait. Uh, that's fine. The discard the thrill. Thrill for a thrill. I guess don't have anything else. Oh, dang it. This is so Oh, alright, nothing. We're doing it. Ate him. Hate us because of the anus. Are we just gonna are we just killing them with like fairy guide mother and all right that's good 
Yep, that's real good. Okay. Yep, that's obnoxious. Land. Land one time. <sighs> Fuck! <sighs> I was hoping to be able to pump one of these guys with this and then also out muscle to kill this, but apparently not. Yeah, that's pretty brutal. Yep, this hand would have been great because, like, even if they draw seven, like, which they're going to do on their turn. Wow, that's really good. Really good. This card is so bonkers. One, two, yep, can't do it. All right. And there's no creature we can play that would actually allow us to do it either. I really don't like trapping into the tower, that does nothing. <laughs> I guess they take three. One land there would have been great. Yeah, it would have been good. I mean, it's turn seven. I don't think a six land would have been that out of the question, but now they have seven cards in hand. This one or this one? This one or this one? Obviously this one. like that because it doesn't trigger it again. My favorite recurring character on Frank Lepore is needing to draw a land and not drawing a land. A classic. Me too. Oh, that's, oh wow. That's good. They're doing all right. Sure. That's good because it's going to trigger both of those things next turn. One on top, one on bottom. Okay. Fashionably late to the party. So we can play these. Mm. I feel so bad, but I really don't think there's going to be a better option here. Just gonna block here and take four, so they go to three. Well, if we're gonna win the game, we're just gonna be by our hairy chin chin. I mean, we're up a game, right? Pretty sure we beat them game one. Yes. They go to three here. Wow, so you would have just lost to Insatiable Hunger? That's crazy. Yeah, but that would require us to have it. We don't <laughs> Insatiable have it. strength or whatever the card called. Well, that's sad. Do you crack witching on to kill the 2-2? Two -two? And you take one. But then we actually make one dude float. One dude floating is all we need to kill them. No, nope, not anymore. Seems good. 
I just draw all my Tome Raiders. Oh, and they make a 1-1-2. One, one, yep, that's pretty good. Seems good. Can I get a land so I can play these bears? That guy's actually very good. Oh, wow. What is this they're doing? Jeez, that's fucking insane. I guess it's actually not that great. Like, this card's just gonna... They either, they either have to have an answer for this or they don't. Like... We don't have another green, so it's only a 4-4, four, four, which means it does die to... What? I don't know. The rare card? The, the uncommon that deals 4 with Adamant? But, like, this guy can't be blocked with creatures of power 2 or less, so it's really... on them to figure out how to deal with that. Also, if they play a ground guy with fly or with, with four, four more power, you can fairy guide mother it, so... I don't know, man. They're saying there's a chance. Yikes. Doesn't do anything, though. This deck is insane, though. Jeez, Double Improbable Alliance and Iron Crag Pyromancer. <sighs> Get out of town. Charlie Brown. cards in hand, huh? Alright. Let's see what happens, I guess. Do they not know they can't chump block this guy? Because they went to blockers pretty quickly there. Yeah, I think they might have not realized that. Maybe we win. Oh, wow. I don't know. This gives me a feeling because we're not going to, we're not going to going, we're not going past the blocker step yet, which means we're sitting in the blocker step thinking about why we can't block. Oh wow! <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> and that's sometimes, uh, have it. sometimes you have a four four that just can't be blocked by any of your dirtily creatures. Thank you guys for watching these past two O drafts. They were pretty sweet. I will see you guys next time. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on patreoncom four. Coolstuffinc.com every Wednesday. Oh, I had an article go up today. I totally forgot. Um, I'm going to link that in the chat right now. And you guys can check that out. Leave me a comment on the article itself. I really appreciate that. You guys are great. Uh, slam those like and subscribe buttons. And I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you later.